Well, good morning and welcome to this week's virtual worship service with the Granville Chapel. I'm so glad that you've joined with us. I just want to point out what you've probably already noticed. Things look different this week. We had a scheduling conflict at the church, so we were unable to gather there to do our recording. As such, Austin and Dallas and myself are all recording from home. We pray that it still works out just fine for everyone. If you hadn't had a chance already, I encourage you to take a look at this week's bulletin. There are several announcements that I want to discuss quickly. First of all, there's no supply meeting tonight. The, the meeting for Sunday, August 16th has been canceled. If you have any questions about that, you can contact Austin directly. I also want to remind everyone that our congregational town hall meeting is next Sunday, August 23rd. We intend to have our officer elections that day, and we really want to encourage those of you who participate in our virtual services to come and be a part of that. We plan to start around 1215. All you need to do is arrive. You can stay in your car in the parking lot. The proceedings will uh, be available on your FM radio. You can just tune to 87.9, and you'll be able to hear everything. We will have one of our leaders in the parking lot there to account for you, to show that you're there, to take roll, and then to hand you a ballot. But if you prefer not to have someone hand you a ballot, then we ask that you follow the link that's there at the end of this announcement. You can fill that out and we will make sure to mail a ballot to your home that you can bring with you. I want you to consider being a part of this meeting if you're a member of the church. This is an important time for us. It's a blessed time. It's a gift to be able to elect our officers. And so I want you to pray about how you can participate, but also pray for Todd and for Doug and for Chase, that God would bless them and that he would bless this election. You'll see a few other things there. I'll point out a couple. First, uh, the young adult lunch on August 30th. So if you're a young adult, college and above, and you would like to come and have some fellowship time with other young adults, I invite you to come to my family's home on August 30th, right after church. We plan to be outside, weather permitting. My family will provide the meal. We just invite you to come and have a good time with others. We've asked you to save the date for Labor Day. For Labor Day, that Monday, we plan to have a physically distanced picnic. There's some details there. We're still working out a few of the details. You can read that, but just pay attention to the upcoming announcements in the email and on Sunday mornings. We plan to have a place um, picked out rather soon and a time detailed rather soon. We hope that you'll consider being a part of that. It'll be good to be together outside sharing our lives and sharing the gospel with one another as well. Lastly, I just want to point out that online prayer meetings resume this week. We'll have one on Wednesday, August 19th at 7 p.m. Be on the lookout in your email and on social media for details of how to connect to that prayer meeting. I really look forward to being with you again. It's such a blessed time to come together and pray with and for one another. Well, I hope that today's worship service is a blessing to you and your family.